Now this is a tutorial about putting the values of the special angles on the unit circle. We first start with the quadrantal angles. Zero. Pi over two. Pi. Three pi over two. And then two pi. We next take each quadrant and split it into three parts. One, two, Each small part has got an absolute size of 30 degrees or pi over 6. So the corresponding angle to this will be pi over 6. The corresponding angles to this one here will be 2 pi over 6 simplifies to pi over 3. Now pi over 2 is 3 pi over 6. The next one here is 4 pi over 6 that simplifies to 2 pi over 3 this one here will be 5 pi over 6 and then 6 pi over 6 that gives you the pi the next one is 7 pi over 6 and then this is 8 pi over 6 that simplifies to 4 pi over 3 And then 9 pi over 6, that's 3 pi over 2. The next is 10 pi over 6, that's 5 pi over 3, when simplified. And then the last one is 11 pi over 6. We now split each quadrant into two parts. So the first quadrant into two parts. The second quadrant into two parts, two parts, and two parts. This here corresponds to 45 degrees, it's 90 divided by 2, which is pi over 4. This one here corresponds to 3 pi over 4, three parts. This is a tutorial about putting the values of the special angles on the unit circle. Let's first start with the quadrantal angles. So this is 0, pi over 2 or 90 degrees, pi, 3 pi over 2, and then 2 pi. We next split each quadrant into three parts, three equal parts. Where each small angle, for example, this angle here will be 30 degrees or pi over six. This angle here will be two pi over six, two parts, which simplifies to pi over three. And then 3 pi over 6, that's the pi over 2, already there. Now this angle will be 4 parts, so it will be 4 pi over 6, that simplifies to 2 pi over 3. This angle here will be 5 pi over 6. 6 pi over 6, that's pi. 7 pi over 6. 8 pi over 6 that simplifies to 4 pi over 3 9 pi over 6 that 3 pi over 2 this is 10 pi over 6 which simplifies to 5 pi over 3 11 pi eleven pi over 6 and then 12 pi over 6 that gives you the 2 pi. We now split each quadrant into two equal parts. So each small, the, the, this angle for example is 45 degrees or pi over 4. This angle here will be twice pi over 4. Now let's split this quadrant into two parts. This angle here will be 3 pi over 4, 3 parts. 
this angle here will be 4 pi over 4, that's the pi. This angle here will be uh, 5 pi over 4. This will be 6 pi over 4, which is 3 pi over 2. And then the last one here will be 7 pi over 4. And then 8 pi over 4, that gives you the 2 pi.